everyone. So this is just a really quick video to talk about a few things going on in the whole Doctor Who universe. Um, the announcement came last week that The Waters of Mars, the next Doctor Who special, is coming out on November 15th, which is so, so, so soon. I'm literally so excited. Um, we've only got three more specials and three more episodes left with David Tennant, and it's making me just, ah, oh, I'm getting really excited about it. I'm completely... The good thing about being here at uni is that I'm not watching any trailers or anything. Like, I'm, I'm trying so hard to keep myself with only the information that I got from going to Comic-Con this summer and the trailers I saw then, which, to be honest, I've kind of forgotten, and I don't, I don't really want to, I don't know, have any more insight into what's coming up apart from that, because I think I'm going to really enjoy it. I'm such an absolute geek about this. I'm so excited. Um... The other thing that happened is that last week, I don't know how many of you got a chance to catch the two episodes of Sarah Jane Adventures that featured the Doctor. Um, I mean, I really actually quite like the Sarah Jane Adventures. They, I didn't really get into them last time, and then upon the recommendation of a couple of people, I watched a few episodes from the first two series. Um, and it's just like a really cute little spin-off, actually. I think, it's, I think it's done quite well. It's like for a CBBC show as well. I think it's very well done. Um... And The Wedding of Sarah Jane Smith, parts one and parts two, I think was, uh, like, I mean, I think they could have done more with it, but their budget is smaller. And um, I think emotionally as well, it was just quite a good programme, because you finally saw Sarah Jane finding someone who she could move on with, and then, naturally, being in Doctor Who, it just all completely cocks up for her. And also the tricksters are, I think, one of the scariest creatures on the Sarah Jane Adventures. So, um... I think that's done. I think that was done really well. And not to mention the last scene um, with the Doctor and Sarah Jane, which I think was pretty heartbreaking. I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to lie, I did shed a couple of tears, but um, yeah, the end is nigh. I don't know, I'm such a hybrid of absolutely so excited and then also just dreading it. I don't want the era of ten to end and then I also am really excited about Matt Smith and I'm really excited about everything that David Tennant's gonna do and I mean Glorious Thirty Nine, the film that um that he made well he's he's in, um loads of really great actors are in it actually, um, is out some point I think, um, in the same week as The Waters of Mars is out. So we've got loads to look forward to. The Hamlet DVD is coming out um in January, I think, early January. I pre ordered mine already, which was I was really excited to do, but yeah, the era of 10 is nearly over. I mean, how are you guys feeling about that? Um, just thoughts, comments, video responses, anything, countdowns, crazy, I don't know, love ballads to 10 and the Doctor that we will miss so terribly, or hate ballads, but you know, I think I'll step away from those. Um, I hope you guys are all really well, and I hope to make a couple of videos, maybe at least one before the episode actually goes out, the kind of anticipation of it. Who knows? Um, Allons-y, allons-y.